All right, y'all. Zozang is back at y'all again. Got a little surprise in the mail today. Day to uh, unbox something. See what we got cracking here. Guess we got to do the old. Ta da! She pretty. She real pretty. First is the uh, the old staring damper. I mean, y'all have been through this a dozen thousand times, but. I figured one more ain't gonna hurt y'all. And if nothing else, I got it from my own files, you know what I mean? I may not even put it out. But uh on, let's get started. They packed this thing very good, man. I can't even lie. This, this packaging is very impressive. gonna do it man you wanna do it now if you're gonna do it bro if you're gonna do it you might as well do it right now this thing look kind of bigger than this one though don't it? you think so y'all know how I get down oh no Told y'all you good spot. You know this is my little stop spot. Yo, man. Yo! I'm telling you right now. I'm telling you right now, boy. Zo Zang if left lane in the house. You already know. And uh, what more can I say, man? This thing is beautiful, man. What a machine. All right. So. You know, I ain't gonna walk y'all through all the intro specs and stuff because, you know, I've seen several few people's videos telling you what's on this thing, the wattage and all that stuff. I so I don't need to tell you because I know you already know. If you're interested in this vehicle like I was and you're researching it, you know. And I'm telling you, it's all that in a bag of chips. This thing is incredible, bro. All right, like, you, like I said, now I got the Cabo Wolf King GT. It was the first scooter I brought. I guess I didn't come up and walk through the ranks of going through this, this. I went straight to the Cabo Wolf King because, you know, I'm a, I'm a rider though. I've already, I, I ride bikes all my life and I ride 1,000, 1,200, so I ride power. So, um, a friend of mine last summer got into a real bad accident, man. And you know, you sometimes you got to pay attention to the omens and the things when they're telling you, yo, something might be in the mix. So long story short, and a short story shorter, he got into a bad accident, man. So uh, I kind of said, I need to put these bikes down. So I put them down. And I lasted through the summer, actually, man. I made it through the summer. You know, I'm even a winter rider, man. As long as there ain't no snow on the ground, I ride. 
and I made it through the winter. But man, I started getting that itch, man. So I get on YouTube, I'm watching YouTube, just other stuff. Man, and I run into the Cabo Wolf King. And I'm like, listen, okay, that's a scooter. It's fast, but it's a scooter. I'm downgrading, that's all I'm looking at. I jumped on that Cabo about two months ago. Totally impressed, blown away power, speed, whatever. But then I started paying attention to this animal. The biggest thing about the Cabo for me, you know, I ain't no young dude. So my knees, man, all my joints got mileage on it. You know what I mean? And the suspension on the Cabo is good in the back, you know, it's cool. But that front suspension, man, with the motorcycle shocks, without the motorcycle tires, without the motorcycle angle to, to uh, dampen the uh, impact, man, you can, that, you're gonna feel them things on your joints. I'm telling you right now, it's my maiden voyage. Man, this thing feels like I'm riding on a trampoline, a pillow or something. And it's totally, completely adjustable. So any, you know, anything that I need to change up or make, I can do it, bro, on the fly. You see the knobs, you see the knobs. I can just boop, 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 boop. Man, this thing is just absolutely, it's incredible, man. I, just, I don't even know what other way to describe it. And uh, so far, I am totally pleased although i've been on it for every bit of 25 minutes but uh if this is if the rest is anything like what i've already experienced brother um this is what's up bro like period this will be my summer wreck i'm figuring the nami this here is going to serve my off-road purposes because i like you know i like riding the street but i want to be able to just ride through anything i want and this is just you know basically more quick i'm gonna throw some pmts on it without question I might even go knobby, only because I got the Wolf King for the streets. I want this for really, I brought this really, you know, well, as far as my company, I brought it to, to do street team work, to be able to move around, get around, you know what I'm saying, promotionals and do all the other stuff I need to do and don't have the confines of a car. I can go anywhere, do anything. But I also gonna get me some recreation out of this thing too. And this will be for the woods. For the Barrett Trails, man. For, you know, the rough spots. And I think I'm going to love it, man. I really do. But uh, I'm not going to run my mouth too much. I figured I did a couple of turnarounds. Let y'all enjoy a little bit of scenery. Let y'all hear my mouth. Let y'all hear a little bit of music. I'm going to finish taking y'all on this brief little ride. I'm not going to film it all. I'm just going to give y'all little bits and pieces. Because I don't want to make this too long of a video. But, uh, so Zangief left Lane out.